Hey everyone, hope you're having an amazing day. It's Ari Savage and today I'm bringing you a very special flipping video. And now that it's double XP week, it is extremely good to be flipping. And if you guys are new to flipping, you'll definitely be able to take something out of this video as long as you guys just follow along with me. And if you're more experienced, you can still take some things out of this video, such as the items I will be flipping. It might give you a little bit of ideas and help you guys make some money. So I hope this video helped you guys a lot. And if it does hit that like button, but now let's get into it. All right, so just a quick explanation on what flipping is or other people like to call it merching. It is basically when you buy items from the GE for a lower value and sell it for a greater value and the margin for that item is the profit you'll be making. So that's very important to keep in mind when you guys are flipping because that is the basics of it. You want to find the items with the greatest margin and a large buy limit so you guys can profit the most out of your items. Now guys, it's time to show you one of my favorite items to be flipping during double XP. And when I'm looking for these items, I'm mainly just thinking about what I did during double XP. And then I take those items and check the margins and see which one has the best margins. So right here, I'm going to test this out and I'm also going to show you guys my sale history and how much profit I was able to make the other day from flipping some of these items. So here we go. We're checking the sale history. And wow, just look at the gap on this margin right here. That is almost 400 coins just from these clean torso. And you can see the buy limit is 10,000. So this is going to be a huge flip for us. So if you guys are following along with me, I wouldn't be adding the same price. You want to check the price for yourself. And even when I buy the items, I check the price again. So when I sell it, I can have a quick sell. So that's a very important to do. So 8105. And another thing is you only want to put your items in for one GP more and this will make sure the margins don't get smaller and it'll help other people flip as well. So just never increase this too much. You'll be actually hurting your profits as well if you do that. So I only do one GP and you might think it's going to be quicker if you add more GP and maybe you're right, but it's just really not worth it to cut into your profits like that, especially when you don't have to do anything, but just sit here and wait. But there we go, guys. If you followed along with me, you basically just did your first flip and you're almost halfway done to completing it. You just have to wait until these buy. And then once they completely buy, it should be a few hours later. And by that time, the margins have probably changed. You want to go back in and buy one more clean torso, check the price on it and sell it for the value that you bought it at and just go one GP lower so you can get a little bit of a quicker sell but that's basically all there is to the flipping and now it's time to show you guys my sale history and some of the items I was able to flip and make a ridiculous profit on in a short amount of time so right here we have the clean torso uh, herbs right here so 8577 is how much I sold them for and let's check out what we bought them for. So we scroll down here. We bought them for only 83 mil. So that is a 2.7 million flip on only one slot in the Grand Exchange. So keep that in mind. The GE has eight slots. So just imagine you can be filling these up with a bunch of items and making a lot of money. So we're going to continue going. We got another herb here. We got Lanta Dimes. And these are just herbs that are used for herb lore potions. Uh, I know people like to do overloads during double XP, a very popular thing because they're the best combat potion to make. And it's just great uh, herb lore XP. Also, I'm going to show you guys, I got some uh, super magic potions and I have them in the three dose because these are the potions used to make the extreme magic potions, which are then used to make the overloads. So it's just a whole cycle that I looked at. And I just thought these would be great items to flip. So if there's any other items I missed, you can obviously, I didn't do the super strength potion. You could probably try that. And just a bunch of items that people would use during double XP. Just try those out. And these are just a few that I have done and have been successful with. So next we go with clean lantadime. We spent 86.5 basically on them, or we actually sold them for it. And then we're going to check how much we bought them for. 84 mil so another 2.6 or 2.5 million flip right there and then for these next few items the diamond sailfish and blue bubber fish we just got a little one mil margin around there as well as the super magic potions we got a 700k profit so it's not too bad on those but obviously some items are better than others so you just got to keep testing it out and it's definitely a learning game on this flipping 
but now I want to show you guys one scenario where it did go wrong for me so I bought these super attack potions and when I price checked them before I sold they went down in value which is a very annoying thing that happens when you're flipping so I decided to put them back in at the price I bought them for but see they have not sold yet and I'm just gonna probably leave these here it could be a better idea to sell them and get my money and then invest that money into more flipping and probably end out even in the long run but just for now I'll see where this goes wait a few more hours and if they don't sell I'll just lower the price so just keep that in mind as well and already look at this my clean torso are buying right now if you guys would like you can probably take these out and put them in but most likely you have your slots full so you're gonna want to wait until these buy well that's all i have for you guys in this video and in the comment section below if you guys want to help each other out list some items that you were successful flipping with during this double xp weekend but other than that make sure you guys like comment and subscribe and i'll see you in the next video